Hi, I'm back. Uh, is the yard sale the only place you can find meat mill treasures? No. You can find them at consignment shops, thrift shops, secondhand stores, estate sales, auctions, and also storage unit sales. And of course, backyard sales and garage sales. And of course, churches and communities get together and have really big sales. Sometimes they'll have them on a weekend, make it last all weekend, so that they can raise money or just like everybody wants to get together and get rid of stuff. Uh, the kind of things you can find would be clothing, tools, furniture, toys, um, glassware. Maybe paintings, such as this right here. Uh, as old as it may be. And this one here seems like it might be a very old painting. Might be worth a lot of money. Myself. I enjoy going to yard sales because same reason everybody does. Looking stuff cheap. And it's really a lot of time to uh, go looking for all those little items here, there, you know. Um, even sometimes finding items that are so old, you have not even got a clue of what it might be. Treasure hunting. That's what I call it. Uh, that is where. I go look for things because it's a challenge to go haggle with the owners about how much you want for, oh, maybe that old tent that you're no longer using. He says, $20, I say 10 or, uh, Getting, it's just the fun of getting things cheaper than what they might want. It's a challenge to me. My friends and I, we get together and we make our list and then we separate for the day and then we'll go to different places, find different items, come back and compare notes. See who got what item for the cheapest price. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. It, it, it really makes for an interesting weekend. And we really have a blast with it. In the next 24 hours, if you're ready to lose weight and help us reach our team. And not only do we go to yard sales, we do go to the flea market. Or we go to storage units. Sometimes they have who you get on a, a unit and you get everything, have no idea what's in it. Or maybe sometimes they'll have it out like garage sale style. And you got your estate sales also. And it, it's just a lot of fun to be going and looking around in those places. It sounds like a great way to spend the day, doesn't it? To go out in search of the unknown little gadget or piece of furniture, whatever might catch your eye. Because as they say, some people's junk is other people's treasures. I know I would sure like to be like the lady shoes that bought the China Bowl today, I heard on the news. 
And Tammy found out that China Bowl was worth She paid $3 for it. That China Bowl, she got $20 million. And found out its value was. And so, I know what I'm doing this weekend. I'm going to go enjoy myself looking at some, for some treasures at yard sales. Have fun.